Hello everybody and welcome back to another edition of Cocktails of Christmas and on the seventh day of Christmas my true love gave to me a Christmas in a glass. So this one is a big batch cocktail for all of your holiday parties that you're going with a couple of friends. Honestly, you could probably drink the whole thing with like four of you, so four is a big batch in my world. And we're going to need a bottle of Marquette Rosé, still, and then a spiced cranberry. So how to spice this? I just use one of those spice sachets with cinnamon, nutmeg, all of that. Put it over the stove for about a half an hour and you're all good to go. So we're gonna do full bottle of each. I could do it at the same time, but I'm not that coordinated. And then we're gonna go with the cranberry. You could use cranberry without spicing it too. I just like that added layer to it. And there's your wine elements. And then you're gonna go in with pomegranate juice, about a cup. Again, measure with your heart. I don't believe in measuring cups. And then you're gonna do about just a little bit of orange. I have one orange mainly is for color, but the flavors are mild in there. Maybe. And then about, again, measure with your heart, probably 10 little drops of orange bitters. Just to add a little bit more of that orange flavor. And that's really your cocktail in there. You're gonna let that sit for a couple of hours and then put it in your glass your glaze. If you know more of a rose, it's a glaze. Fill your glass with your cocktail. Take some ginger ale or club soda if you don't like ginger. And pop it. And there is your Christmas in a glass. Perfect for parties or Thursday night. Oh yeah, that's spice. It hits. Anyway, cheers, guys.